Hi everyone, welcome back to Soulforge Campaign. Now, by the looks of it, excuse me, this doesn't unlock, which means you have to pay for it with money. <clears throat> excuse me, uh, a little bit under the weather, sinuses, migraine, yay, fun stuff. Um, now, I don't know if the card that you would win from these two are unique just to here, or if you can get them elsewhere. But either way, I think this is really, really terrible. This is a, a pay to, not pay to win, but it's like pay to unlock, pay for content when they advertise this to be a free game. Not a fan. Um, I did say before, um, I did get my gold coins, which will be used to unlock this, uh, as they gave some away uh, at Christmas time. So that's where I got mine. But yeah, I, I'm not a fan of what they've done here. However, disregarding that, we are going to unlock this. Oh, they added the option to pay by silver. Okay, it was that was not there before. That's new. It was only by gold um, last week. So you can unlock it with silver. As you can see, it will take a lot. Which, actually, I'm going to pay for silver. You know, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm going to use silver here. And I didn't read the description. Well, well, let me move this now. I will not. Well, the dark. I'll have to read the description afterwards by the looks of it. And we'll see how this goes. You have proven yourself a powerful forge barn. Worthy of my trust. I am needed here to defend Tars uh, Tarsus. Even now, my eternal enemy seeks to harness the power of my dusk uh, spire in order to rise again. Go, you must stop the dragon wake before Amadan gains domination over all the dragons of Solus. I cannot resist its call. I answer your call, Amadan. So. Uh -huh. Um, I have no idea what the special ability is. And give me one second. So, I think I'm going to unlock this to start with. So, um, Siri Hand of Verna. And we'll get our, it will do something and then we shall see. Oh, look at that! I'll be able to boost it. Okay. First strike. Like a shadow dragon that it lasts for one turn, perhaps? Hmm. Okay, now... Okay, yeah, you have generation, you have movement. You are just a uh, defender, and then second level and third level, you unlock stuff. Okay. Alright, so let's go like that, and... Huh. Let's unlock this. So we're going to boost the strength in that, and then... We'll see about those cards, if we get them again. Uh, uh, two of them? Okay, that was a lot of cards played at once. Dooming Drake Dyer. What does this do? Mobility. When Doom... Thing moves into a lane. Destroy another level 1 creature in that lane. And let me guess. Now hang on. Level 2 and then any. Okay. You are playing extra cards. Uh, 
I'm gonna play you there. Let's see if we can get some life. Not quite working. That was intentional. I knew it wouldn't kill it. I'm kind of feeling this first match out here. Ah, see there. These two will kill. Uh, Duskmire Twilight Drake. <sighs> I see... Just taking it, it deals. F okay, sorry, I missed that in the when it's second level. Um, when it enters the field, it deals five damage to another creature in this lane. I am not going to kill him. Let's do that because I want to activate it. Playing a creature would have been better, yes, but I do want to get it to level two. Ah, there we go. Echo Wisp, yes. Doom uh, the Twilight, and it vanishes. I have no way to. Ugh, yeah, for probably so. Okay, Scorch Main Dragon and some Smolder Scale Dragon. So, what's the difference for you? At the end of your turn, Smolder Scale Dragon deals one damage to each creature and opponent controls. Nasty little dragon, nasty. Okay. Um. Huh. Okay, I'm gonna kill you with that because I don't think it's going to survive. Alright, yeah, down 74 light. Oh, I have done... Uh, okay, I... Uh, uh, d d d I want to read the text! Game! Um... Uh, hold on one second. Uh, I'm gonna pause the recording here for a moment. If I remember the keys. That's not the key. Okay, there we go. Sorry about that. I should have waited two extra seconds. Uh, I apologize. Alright, so we do want to kill this off. Now, this would be in. You're good there. And you are good there, so we'll do that and see how that works out. Now getting Spring Dryad 2, now that, that can be good. I... Uh, that sucks. That, no other real world for that. Uh, Scorch Mane Dragon, yep, okay. Play card. Thank you! I hate it when it does that. Uh, just because? Well, it does lower it that I can kill it this turn, so I won't do damage. And we're gonna... Hang on. How much does it get again for level 2? Plus 2 plus 2. Or we're level 2, we can give it um, 2 or higher an additional 2-2, two -two, so we can give it a 5-5. Five -five. I think we're going to go with that. Honestly, I think that's the nice little meat there. Oh, we got that one too. An 8-10. Ha ha! So it turns out... Uh, okay, hang on. Scorch Main Dragon 2. Yeah, we are level 2, so. 
Uh, deals five damage to another creature. Yeah, that ain't so hot. Um, comes into play that way. So let's try this. Yeah, I'm 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 banking a lot on the spring dryad here. Not the best choice in the world, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. I would love to. Ooh, right, that's a level three. Oh, please let me play Scorch Main Tracer. Okay, Staff of Varnus. And what happened? Do you live? Do you live? You lived! Oh, we're gonna hit hit hard. A uh, Doom Drake two. Doom Dire Drake. Uh, two or lower. You didn't kill it. Hmm. All right. Yes. I think you can see why I would do that. Now, this is playing out just slightly off where I would want to... Uh, Well, if I choose to attack, take the 12, it's a big hit for sure, but then let this die, and then my other card, I play this too, so on its turn, I can block it, and without some kind of a debuff on this or a buff on this, this cannot kill the Spring Dryad outright. Also, I'll be boosting its defense by playing that. I think that's how I'm going to do it, if you are able to follow all of that. So I'm going to get hit. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. 21 defense. Now, this will kill the Doomwing Drake unless it moves it. Yes. Mm-hmm. Tricky. Tricky, tricky. Oh, there we go. That's a nice one. Oh, shit. Well, it, he got me on that one. Not really much you can do. Okay. Now, this is a free play. So, this will kill the Doom Drake. Duskmaw Twilight Drake. Okay. When you play a Tendrils of Twilight, targeting a creature in this lane, destroy that creature. Oh, okay. Tendrils of Twilight. Target a creature in this lane, destroy the creature. Okay, so it's the same thing. And it has mobility 1. It doesn't change. Alright. So, let's play the free card first. You die if it will click. Thank you, Mouse. Took a while there. Um, <clears throat> oh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking because I have thirteen health. So, if I play this there... I would really need three cards to come up, which I can't do. You go here, because I have to block you, and I might as well do some nice damage. You go here... Because you can't attack this turn, and this can't attack this turn. So it'll block a first strike thing there. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. No, that didn't work out. Didn't quite play it right, but I really didn't have anything to go with there, so... 
Now, what do you do? Okay, so it remains unlocked, thankfully. Now, here, let's see. Now I can read this and we can go into the second attempt. Sorry for the out of order. You defeated the last of the Zith and recovered the final legendary Herald Relic. Before you have time to celebrate your victory, a pulse of brilliant light illuminates the stormy sky. From out of the swirling vortex hovering above, Tarsus emerges a massive dragon. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> a massive dragon belching dark fire from its twisted maw. Just before the wave of shadow and flame washes over you, a barrier of shadow in intercepts the blast. Varanus steps out of the living shadow to stand before you. I will take care of our draconic friend. You must stop our foe from completing the Dragon Wake ritual before it is too late, and all the dragon's souls are his to command. There we go. Now we got the little bit of backstory going there. All right. Okay, let's see here. I think I had kind of have the right idea. We just went through this. I'm not going to read it again. Okay. What is a good start? Actually, this is. I would love to get the level 3 Echo Wisp for this battle. I think it would be very beneficial. This. Okay. Uh, uh, anything else you want to do? Okay, and then you... Okay, this one. Dismark uh, Dark Twilight. Okay. Okay. So you kill that, so I'm fine with that. But hang on. No. Cancel. This is what I want to do. Contagion Surge. Yes! So I want to be able to get the Contagion Surge and the other one to be free cards, because they will be Extremely beneficial, I think, in this battle. Ah, Primal Surge. Perfect! Not much. Uh, uh, I hate it when he does that. Just, you know, saying. Okay, so... No, I'm going to put the 3 there and the 5 there, so we can kill that. Um, now, where do I want the Primal Sword? I'd rather get the Regeneration going, but... Huh. No, we're going to put it on you. I'm going to try and keep you a leave. A leave. We're going to try and keep you a leave, you know, because a leave is good. Okay, okay. Oh, two of them. Well, I got real one. That's good. Okay. Alright. Ghastly Touch, I think, will be very beneficial. So I'm going to kill you. Grove Matriarch? No, actually. I think we're going to go with the uh, Patriarch. Where would Patriarch? Boosting the Ether Hound. In terms of damage, these two cards are going to do the same. This one will stay alive s just as long, actually, in this case. Because that is trapped. Oh, Tarsus Deathweaver. I get another one. Oh, yes. Okay. You can't go wrong with that kind of combo. <clears throat> I like having two Tarsus Death Weavers out and then getting that second card. It, it, it's kind of sweet. Alright. 
So I was able to hit it for four damage. Not a lot. Not a lot. Ooh, -hoo. Patriarch is there. Grove Matriarch is there. Stuff of Varnus. Ugh. Okay, that's like hitting twice. And that's what that funny animation is. So I get hit for 20, and it only has 10 health. That I am not happy about. Just put it that way. I played that wrong. But I attack that. That dies. So does that. Leaving an opening. Huh. Let's try and keep it alive for one more round. Okay, so we got some okay things here. Actually, we got some nice combination of things. I really hate that ability. I'm just going to state that right now. I really hate that ability. Okay, Smoldering Dragon. Deal to these creature controls. We shall kill it this turn by using that. Ghastly Touch. May as well unlock the third one. <sighs> I don't feel that's a waste, considering... Oh, I don't know. It's free. Do we want to boost? Or place a creature? They're all level 1s. I think place a creature. Okay. It's a close-ish fight. Staff, oh, so we get hit twice, and that dies, and we get hit for 20. I really hate that. Frostmane Dragon. Now, what do you do? Uh, at the start of your turn, if Frostmane Dragon enters the field from your hand on your previous turn, you may uh, put level 1 egg in. Okay. I kind of understood that. And I think that's the best way to put it. I kind of understood it. Okay, let's go like this. Primal Surge is free. So you can go like that. No matter where it moves, it dies. I like that. And nothing I have dies this turn. So we're completely protected for the moment. We got a little bit of life, and this is down to the wire. Ah, uh, now I pull a uh, regen. Ha! Oh, oh, Jesus. Okay, you're gone. I can do six point... No, hang on, hang on, hang on. You have 11 health, I have 13. And... Plus seven. Yes, we win. We win this one. I don't even know what is really a good strategy against this one. This one's a very difficult one to wrap around because of this constant... Oh, I'm just going to destroy a card because I can thing going. Very... Frustrating is uh, probably a good word for it. Um, and I just want to play a card. So I'm going to play you. And we win! So let's see what uh, lovely text we have. How long your mission is complete? Dragon Week. Legendary. Search your deck for a dragon. And put a copy of it in one of your available spaces at random. It gets first strike. Nice. Um, no flavor text after that? Oh, okay. So how is the... Uh, okay. Maybe if you wait X amount of time, it gives you silver as an option? Or maybe you have to generate enough silver to have that as an option. It was 155,000 to unlock Dragon Wake. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure. 
Anyways, um, we were able to defeat Dragon Wake on the second attempt. Wish I could help you out with a basic strategy. I just kind of kept flowing and changing and hoping for the best. Oh well, it worked. Anyways, I, I hope you enjoyed the uh, video. And I hope you'll join me again for the, I think, possibly last battle in the uh, campaign story. But until then, please be safe, everyone. Bye.